I'm just going to work through all the way C7, T1, all the way down to T12. If I want to work into extension, we can have a finger contact or I quite like a nice flat contact, thena hypothena, allow the patient to rest in, and then we're just working through into extension. Nice and gentle, nice and rhythmical, pushing through. And all we're doing is just lifting up at the front and just reinforcing nice and gently with our thena hypothena contact at the rear. From there, we can then begin to work into side bending. So my armpit is just over the shoulder. And then as I dip down, just relax in. As I dip down, we'll come into a little bit of side bending there. If I want to reinforce this, I can just have a nice broad contact against the spinous processes at this side. And then we can just slightly reinforce into side bending. Nothing too major. We don't want to be pushing in too aggressively into that body prominence. Just a little bit of side bending. And then from there, if I'm wanting to work in to rotation, I will begin to step this lead leg around the couch. So as I come around on this heel, we're moving around in this position. And again, it's just transferring the weight from one foot to another. So my arm and shoulder are locked in place, securing the patient. And that's almost a lever and everything here is the pump. And again, to reinforce, we can just begin to walk around. And we can hold it at the end. We can ask them to resist and pull back to turn it into an MET. Again, they can resist. And from there, we can look to get a little bit more rotation. And even when we're in rotation, again, we can just induce a little bit of side bending. Or even from that position, walking into extension. And back to the middle, I'll show you from this side. So we're in here, again, if I'm moving around this way, my right leg is my right leg. And then from here, side bending, and just working in this pump manner here, going just side bending enough to reinforce, and at the spinous process, and just work through. Rotation, heel, and allow the toe to guide you around, like so. We can wait here, one or two deep breaths, back off slightly, and again, begin to try and walk around, and get a little bit more rotation, come back slightly, rest in, and then work through side bending in that position. If you want to increase the extension a little bit, we can go back to this forehead to forearm, rest in this position here, nice long arms, then just working through into extension. Again, I'm not a fan of these bony, bony prominence contacts. It can be quite sensitive for the patient, so I much prefer just a nice big flat contact with thena hypothena, like so. Seated thoracics. Everyone happy with that?